Belinda. I own Belinda Lee Designs, a small embroidery and sewing studio in Raleigh, North Carolina. I specialize in embroidered art, and I'm here to introduce a new video series on turning special items into something else. How did I get this idea? Well, if you've been following my blog, you'll know that I recently had a paradigm shift with how I view the embroidery I create. You see, I've had an online shop for a few years selling embroidered pillows like these. You know, pillows with monograms or a special design, particularly ring bearer pillows. But recently, I stitched a family tree design as a gift to my mother-in-law. Something like this. Now, if your house is like mine, all pillows eventually end up on the floor, either victims of a mad pillow fight or by sheer accident. And this pillow, no, this piece of art was too special to be thrown on the floor. It simply couldn't become a throw pillow. This would-be pillow was destined to become a wrapped canvas instead. And there it was, my aha moment. Now you must be wondering, what does this have to do with the do-it-yourself video series? Am I right? Well, this epiphany got me wondering, what else can I make with my embroidered art? So I started a list of all the something else's this embroidered artwork could become. Now let's pause here and I'll tell you that I do teach sewing and nothing is more fun than having my studio full of fellow creators and watching the awe and self-respect that blossoms as they create something with their own two hands. So as I admire my growing list, naturally I thought about sharing these things in classes with them. But I quickly realized I couldn't possibly teach classes on all these things. My crafty friends and followers aren't all close by and they can't come over every Saturday night for 35 weeks. That's how many something else has made it onto my list that first day. Well, and you guessed it, that's where this video series was born. Now I hear you, you don't have an embroidery machine, but I do. And every single one of these designs, you can find them on my store online. But don't stop at embroidered art. Think about all of the special things you have hanging around already. A piece of printed fabric, like this, or that you had made out of your child's artwork possibly, maybe a christening gown or an old college sweatshirt. There's so many special things hanging around your house, just dying to get a new life as something else. Now this poor video series, it doesn't quite have a name. So if you have a good idea, please either share it on my blog at www.belindaleadesigns.com or if you're watching on YouTube, you can just leave a comment below the video. The first video we'll be doing will be how to turn embroidered art into a wrap canvas, like this piece of fabric or this one right here. Please watch this spot, or better yet, subscribe to the blog so you can be the first to know whenever there's a new video. I'm so excited to get started making something else with you. See you soon. To think about it, I'm gonna put those sticker quicker. Turn special items into something else. I freaking hate this video. That's right, embroidered art.